All right, hey, some bus fans. I am on my way out to the farm to work on laying some mortar in the shower pan. Uh, Hannah most recently put the pan liner down uh, with Dave the other day, so we're gonna get out there and mix some mortar and see what we can about getting a nice gray down to the drain so the water drains properly. Um, obviously, we're gonna have to like let it sit and dry for a day or two before I come out there and make sure that um, it's looking all good. But uh, today we're gonna lay it down and hopefully get some sweet footage of that. So I uh, hope you're stoked. Let's get it. videos on how to he said how to make the how to lay your shower liner which Hannah did and then how to lay your mortar for your shower pan DIY style so I'm working on that now the next step I'm working on right now is trying to get it to grade down to the drain which seems to be the hardest part of all of this and he said he was always pretty good at just eyeballing it so I'm trying my best to do the same um, it's proven to be not the easiest thing in the world, but I got a level here and I'm trying my best to get it done. Um, so yeah, well, uh, we're hoping for the best. Yeah. Just got Dave to come take a look at it. He's feeling kind of sick today, so it's been mostly just me doing the work, but he says it's going to look pretty good. I should just keep smoothing it out. Um, and he said even if it's not like perfectly smooth and level, uh, we're going to go to lay the thin set for the tile. We can get it uh, nice and finished off there, which is great. Um, the hardest thing right now is there's the tiny space right there where the between this drain and the wall here. Getting that to be graded is going to be the hardest thing, but um, I don't think I'm doing too bad of a job at it. I got this little guy. It's going to be great. I'm loving it. My name is Mason, after all, so I'm a stone mason. Working with mortar so that... It's basically the same thing. Oh, baby, yeah. All right, well, as you can see, I've decided to call it. Uh, based off this, we're going to come back tomorrow and... See what we can to make it all nice and level. Um, I don't know. I'm excited about about it. It's my first time ever doing anything like this, and so I was kind of nervous going into it. But I did watch that Star Tile video. I'll link his his video in the description. Uh, watched it a couple times to make sure I was confident and I knew what he was doing. Uh, it was pretty straightforward, you know. You just lay the mortar down there after you mix it and flatten it and try and get it graded. Uh, using a level on it was the best idea that you could do. Make sure that it goes not only from like one corner, but you have to like lay the level here and here and here and make sure it's all going down to the drain, which it sure seems like that's what it's doing when I check it now. So, uh, gonna come back tomorrow and get the moment of truth. Uh, we did have some extra mortar and I wasn't sure what to do with it, but, uh, Hannah's mom had me lay it down over here for a nice step for their chicken coop. Nothing perfect, but, uh, better than stepping in mud to get in there. So. That's pretty cool. I'm glad we found a use for that. But uh, as always, thanks for uh, sticking around and watching the videos. Um, we're excited about getting our shower ready to go. Gonna put some tile down after about a week, or gonna put some red guard down or whatever 
board first and then tile, but uh, thanks for everybody. Have a great day. Mm -hmm.